my god can you guys stop killing my brain available what do you have uh as we discussed yeah, it's one big one so baptized door of uh, like plastic 42,000 pounds Chicago to Wixom, Michigan. Picks up today, 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Delivers as much as possible. So I was just checking if we can make it up. Okay, so did you get me 1100 <laughs> Actually, uh, just a second, okay? I think, as you know, I'm having 900 as this kid. Is there any chance if you could run this for 1000 I mean, I will not. I, I, already, I, already, I already, I already, I already, I already told you. Just, just I get it. I already told you, eleven hundred is my lowest dollar. Sorry. All right, let's do it. I'm sorry. Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, so now you can pay eleven hundred. It's just like you're taking, you know, a customers paying nine hundred, and uh, I need to get this load picked up. That's it. I don't want to, I mean, I requested you, right? I requested you if you can, but uh, uh, I wanted my long weekends to be good, but, you know, no worries. Okay, is this your direct number? Yes, it is. Okay, uh, you have extension? Uh, no, you can just call me on a summer. Okay. I just want to confirm, not even like 1050, I mean, it just like, you know, I no, I cannot. Like no, bucks. I cannot make ten fifty. So it has to be eleven hundred. And right. what was what was your MC one more time? Two one zero four Eddie Smith. Eddie Smith, really? Yeah. Are you located in America, Eddie Smith? What did you say? Are you located in America, Eddie Smith, or you are outside of, of USA? Of course, we do. Really? No, we are in Detroit, Michigan. I'm just oh. curious because we have no we have worries. we have Brad Pitt calling, we have Matt Damon calling, we have Jennifer Lopez. So a lot of dispatch services or brokers who are located outside of the country, they just uh, use famous names. So that's why I'm asking: Is it really your name? You or... <laughs> so is you that really you? My office. You can just check my office. It's in Okemos, Michigan. All right, two four two two Jolly Road, Okemos, Michigan. So I mean. Are you are you born in Michigan? No, it's not. Where were you born? Nevada. Ooh, Nevada. Sounds good. Which state yeah. which city in Nevada? I wouldn't like to disclose it. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Because you don't remember you, know, you, know, you don't remember any city no, besides Las Vegas? <laughs> Las, Las, oh God, come on now. I'm not for you for that. No, it's fine. How is the you're weather just, in Michigan uh, today? You're just curious to... How is the weather in Michigan today? It's not good. It's not good? Why not? I mean, I don't like it, so yeah. What, what don't you like it? <laughs> what don't you like it? What did he say? What don't you like about weather I in like, Michigan? Uh, I, I, like, I like it to be, you know, windy and all the stuff, so temperature, like, is 95 right now, so... I mean, it's 87 degrees out there in Detroit. Oh, well, that's not that bad. You can just check the Google as well. Yeah, that's what Google tells you? Or that's what outside yeah. of your office tells you? No, why not? I mean, you're asking me, so that's why I'm asking you. <laughs> that Should I tell you the weather report or <laughs> we just should put blue, mm -hmm. right? No, I just like to when people are honest, but it's okay. No worries. If you are curious, I can I can answer you all of your uh, all of your questions. That's not an issue. I'm here for you, right? Well, you where do where where is your office in Michigan? Where is your office in Michigan located? It's next to my my house, you know. Oh, Okimos, it's, Okimos. it's next to your house. Yeah, ten ten fifteen minutes walk from my house. Uh, I don't say that you want to, uh, I mean, you know, you want my address for my house. No, I don't. No, I don't. <laughs> so what are you going to do for the holiday? What did you say? What are you going to do for a holiday? I just working. I got three loads. One going from uh, Washington, Ohio uh, to Sterling, Illinois, picking up on Sunday. One picking up for, uh, I think, uh, you know, 4th of July, right? Going, oh God, just a second, just a line, shipper, just a second.
got two more loads actually just now. Oh, so you're not gonna you're not, you're not gonna days. have that day off for the fireworks? <sighs> no, I want to, but I don't have that th that time. You know, I I'm having uh, three four loads to cover, and I think it'll take all the time. Wow, today is only Thursday. You still have Friday. We have off on uh, Saturday, Sunday, and no, Monday. I do. I, it's like uh, it's my you know it's my preference that I book the load only on the day of the pickup because there's no back off. You know there are so many like shit trucking companies who book the load and then just back off. And the brokers are just like you know they don't have any option going negative and all the stuff. Okay. Well, it was nice chatting with you. Oh, I, I think I am gonna skip this, but um, good luck to you, hon. Eddie Smith. For sure, Alex. Well, of course, Alex. Okay, thanks. Bye. Would you like to cover this one or not? No, I'm not. As I told you, I like when people no honest when people honest with me. And you just had to, you gave me too many ideas no. that you not telling me the truth. So sorry, but no, sorry. Yeah, like you said, it's a lot of shitty. Mm -hmm trucking companies there but it's also a lot of shitty brokers so unfortunately no i'm not gonna yes, do my trucks yes they so. are yes they are yes they are of course why not but i am the one who just if i book load even if i'm getting uh even like i'm getting 900 from the customer i offered you 1100 i booked load for 1100 dollars even if i'm getting thousand dollars from other trucking company after booking load with you i won't accept it because i have gone through that phase then we just cancel a load and uh, you're just, you're not having anything in your hand, right? So I just don't want anyone to be, you know, just going through that phase again because I've, I've did already. So yeah, that, that's the a cool thing. So if you still, if you still think that uh, broker, I mean, we as a brokers are not good at seven star. You can check the DAT, mm -hmm. you can check our MC. If you're like having any issue it's up to you because i cannot force you right it's your truck you have to move it you have the dispatcher you have the driver on it and i, I cannot help it out right so if you want i'm on this i'm serious on the load if you would like to uh cover this one i'm just available for you right now okay you sounds good know. i mean you can just tell me right now right okay thank you eddie of course alex thank you so much uh -huh. bye, bye oh my god Really, Eddie Smith from Michigan, born somewhere in Nevada. You telling me that first you could pay only 900. Now you're going to pay 1100. Well, I was not born yesterday. So sorry, sorry, but no. Find a desperate dispatcher. Yes, how can I help, sir? Actually, man, we have some really good things. You're saying coming out from Illinois, so we're looking for so may I know which type of truck or trailer do you have? What are you guys? We are the dispatchers and we have some really good paying loads. That's why I'm trying to reach you. Just try the loads. The loads are paying good. Okay, Illinois. what's the name of your company? Friendly Dispatch. I'm sorry? Friendly, Friendly Dispatch. Friendly Dispatch, where are you located? Located in Island, New Jersey, man. Okay, how many dispatchers do you have? Uh, we have about 70 plus dispatchers with the experience of 8 plus years here available. Professional, professional dispatchers. Okay, so what are you, what kind of equipment are you working with? Working with the brokers directly. With what kind of equipment, brokers. what kind of equipment are you working with? Like we work with power only, dry van, reefer, flatbed, septic. Okay. Which type do you have? We have dry vans. Are you located in USA or outside of USA? Am I saying uh, we are located in Island, New Jersey, and we work in the whole US in the forty-eight states of US? Are you dry? Are your dispatchers are uh, sitting in USA or they are outsourced in a different country? In the USA. Are you sure? Because sounds like you're somewhere probably in India. Ma'am, I'm saying I am here in Italy, New Jersey. I'm a student. I'm here in the university and a part time. Oh, yeah? How is the traffic today? How is the traffic today before holidays? It's good. It's good? No traffic? Yeah. Nah, yes. You know, when the holidays, the traffic is good. Like, the more traffic.
Oh, it's more traffic. Because what holiday are we going to have? We have a holiday. Uh, today, there is... Today, man, there is no holiday. I mean, it's coming up. Which holidays are you going to celebrate in New Jersey tomorrow and day after? On, on Monday. Yeah, which holiday? I mean, you live in USA, Monday. right? What the name? <laughs> which holiday are we going to celebrate? Ma'am, are you looking for some good No, business? I am just looking for honest business. So if you're not located in USA, it's okay. Just tell me we sit in somewhere else because if you would be in USA, you knew that it's Independence Day coming up, right? You knew the traffic yes, in New Jersey. You would knew. On hold on. Monday. Hold on. Before, you would knew. Tonight. Hey, hold on. You would knew the traffic in New Jersey is terrible before holidays. Not just okay. So you simply lying to me that you located in USA. But it's okay. As long as you do a good business. So what is your rate per mile right now for dry vans? So, ma'am, the reason is that we have some really good paying loads from... What does uh, it like mean really good paying oil. loads? What does it mean good paying loads? So the thing is that uh, some some loads are going towards Dallas, Texas, some are going towards Atlanta, Georgia, some are going towards Pennsylvania. Like from these, where? Uh, these from are the where? Wars. From Illinois, Chicago, Illinois, Vernon Hills, Illinois. Okay, so and, from Chicago uh, like to Texas, Europe. from Chicago to Texas, how much are you get, getting paid? Uh, okay, wait a minute, man. I'm just checking. Okay. Let's say Chicago to Dallas, Texas. Chicago, Illinois to Dallas, Texas. Okay, so... It's 967 miles. Okay, so you have a dry van? Yes, we have a dry van. So is it 53 feet or 48 feet? 53. That sounds good. Okay. Wait, just wait a second. I'm just checking here. I mean, you tell me example what you were paying your carriers this week. Who is a broker and what was the commodity? Ma'am, uh, in last week, uh, we work uh, less, like uh, my carrier, which have drive and he worked with me like uh, from uh, Michigan, Michigan side. He can every week we hold like 2,500 miles. And last week, his uh, invoice is like... Uh, Seven thousand and eight hundred something like two hundred dollars. Okay, but I'm Last asking you. You said eight. that you have a good paying load from Chicago to Texas. So how much is your good paying load from Chicago to Dallas? I'm just checking, ma'am. Wait a second. So, ma'am, ma'am, I, I just give you an idea because my dispatcher will provide you some multiple load options. I'm okay, so give me example you from your real load. So how much was load covered for? Because you said it's a good load. So how much did he cover it for? Yes, from Chicago, uh, from Chicago, Illinois to Dallas, Texas, it's like uh, giving up to like three, three to five, uh, three to three point five dollars per mile, like three, somewhere three point two dollars per mile. Like really? It's, it's oh, really? So, so, like, so three, like, three dollars, like, three fifty for driving from Chicago to Dallas. Those prices don't exist for the last four months. This is not a realistic numbers. So, so just try try the load options from my dispatcher. If you don't like, <laughs> honey, you know what I don't like? I don't like scammers. I don't like people who call and sell services and giving the numbers which do not exist. So that's what I don't like. Just that is my company's legal document. So just check that. You send what? My company's legal documents that we are in is where, where did you send it to? To your email, just provide me your email. O D A Y today. today, not tomorrow, not yesterday. Today, at gmail.com. Yes. Okay. So what does what is it gonna tell me? It's gonna tell me that what do you offer? Okay, but I do want to have example of what you've been covering. So. so okay. Okay. So so ma'am, what I can do for you because I I am a like new agent here so i can uh, transfer this call to my senior he will provide you some good paying load options what about that oh what about that that would be probably good so transfer me to your senior who 
knows that good paying load that you promised me from Chicago to Texas for three dollars fifty per mile. I would like to see that. Okay. All the promises. Good afternoon, ma'am. How are you doing? I am doing great. How are you? I'm pretty good. It's uh, John here with Friendly Dispatch, James Transfer, uh, James Transfer, you called to me. I'm his senior, senior over here. He told me that you are in Illinois. Uh, yes, we are in Illinois. And can you tell me the location? Where are you in Illinois? Can you tell me the zip code? Oh, it doesn't matter. I have a bunch of different drivers, so we are in Chicago area. Uh, you are in Chicago. Yeah, so Perfect. we have many, we have dry vans. We have dry vans, and your mm -hmm. associate said that he has a uh, loads which go to Texas for three dollars fifty per mile. Okay, okay, okay. I can do. I can do. And your driving is forty eight or fifty three. Fifty three. Perfect. So uh, I have some loads option available coming out from Chicago, Illinois. Some loads are going to uh, Texas side. Some are going to uh, stay in Midwest market like St. Louis, Missouri, Indiana, Ohio, Michigan side. So let's talk about some Texas. He said to... that you have a good paying loads to Texas. So what can you offer for me? Okay. You want you want to go to Texas? <coughs> he said that that's where your good paying loads are for $3.50 no, per actually, mile. So. Okay. Actually, actually, we have many good paying loads option available. Some are going to Midwest, some are going to South Market, and some loads are going to uh, uh, like North Market. So it totally depends on you where you want to go. I can get you load for North Market. I can get you load for So I just South we just market. will start talking you with for... you, sir. Sir, we already discussed this that mm -hmm. we go into Texas. So what can you provide okay. for me from Chicago to Dallas, Dallas back to Chicago? What options do you have and how much you can get me for drive-in? Let me check. Let me check. Just give me a second. So what yeah, are you checking on a uh, power dad? Yeah, uh, I'm checking on my system. I'm checking on my system. Like I'm giving you exactly those options. Like uh, how much I can get you on that load. Like uh, you want to go from Chicago, I don't know, to uh, Dallas, Texas. Total yes. miles are 984 miles, and that load is paying around about yeah, that load is paying around about like $3,200 to $3,300. And on the round trip, I can get you more than that. Like I can get you like $35 to $3,700. So I can make a round trip for you from Chicago to Dallas and Dallas to Illinois, Chicago. Okay, so you have you have the load for $3,200 going to Dallas for tomorrow. Uh, yeah, I can get you load for tomorrow as well. If you need for today, we have some options available for today. And if you want to go for tomorrow, okay. So uh, I, I mean, can we can go today. 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 So so we we are empty, ready to go today. So who is a broker on that load? Hmm. So uh, you just have to sign with me, like it's totally. But free again, before we before we sign with you, I mean, do you really have that load? Who is a broker, and what is the transit there? Listen. Actually, ma'am, the thing is that I'm in sales agent, I'm in the sales department. But uh, for the exact load, for the exact name of broker, for the exact weight of broker, broker, exact average of uh, load, uh, you have to talk to my dispatcher. But for that, you have to sign up with me, but it's totally... Okay, tricky. but like <laughs> well, guys, 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 stop. So you telling me that you're not a dispatcher. So first, the first guy said that he's going to transfer me to dispatcher. You promised me that no, no, you no. have a load for 3,200 and you're not even yeah. dispatcher. So you're just giving me no. average number just out of your head. Do you have, does your yeah. dispatcher has a load for today for 3,200? Yeah. Why don't you call him and ask, what time is it pick up? And I'll sign, I I'll sign my paperwork within five minutes. Can he book my load <laughs> truck for 3,200 going to Dallas today? Yeah, he can do that. Like, he can get you, like, for the Dallas, Texas, Houston, Texas as well, San Antonio, Texas as well. If he have for Dallas, he can get you. And if he have for Houston or San Antonio... No, I don't need to go to San Antonio. No, I just need to go to Dallas and I need to go back. So, so does he has a load for 3200 Because when I look at the load board... The highest paying load is two thousand dollars. So how can you get a load which pays twelve hundred more from where? Uh, 
actually the thing listen actually the thing is that we uh, we have a good relations with some brokers and some shippers so we get loads directly from the brokers and the shippers sometimes we use premium load boards but most of the time we book loads directly from the shippers and brokers so they pay us a good money because uh, we are working with them like 5 to 6 years so they have a trust on us and we have trust on them so that's why i'm just giving you the average amount but when you will talk to my dispatcher he will tell you the exact load uh, exact okay so amount, can i talk to your load, dispatcher exact... can i talk to your dispatcher yeah. before i give you chance yeah. to okay so can i do that yeah you can talk to my dispatcher but for that you have to sign up with me but it's no totally because i don't want to so... waste my time and sign up if i am not sure because this is unrealistic if the market only have 16 loads right now from chicago going to dallas and the highest paying load is 2000 please okay. i am i am not a little girl who you trying to tell storytellers right i've been in this business no, 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 no. so that's why the load which you promised me does not exist so if you can prove me wrong i will sign up with you I'm not promising you for that load. I'm just giving you the example. <laughs> no, that because you told me you business. told me that you can find me the load for thirty two. That you that have the load for thirty two hundred. You said you have it. Now you tell me that you give no, me no, no. example. I, said, I can I give said, you example. Said, well, sometimes I can cover load for four thousand. That would be just an example. So what is in reality said, do you I have? I get you but I don't said I have load I said I can get you but I don't said I have I said I can get you load I can get you that kind of load from Chicago I don't know but I don't said that I have right now I have right now <laughs> I just I was just giving you the examples I I said I can get you I will I will try to get you that load but I don't said that What is your I name sir? What is your name sir? Uh, my name is John Meyer Okay, John 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 Meyer. What are you using the famous names? What is your real name? My name is John Meyer. John Meyer, really? Yeah, yeah. Okay, seriously. And what's your name, by the way? What's your name? Well, by the way? then I'm. Seriously, my name is John then, Meyer. Then then I'm gonna be uh, Jennifer Lopez. <laughs> If you are John Meyer, I'll be okay. Jennifer Lopez. Okay. No problem. No problem. You can you can be you can be a Jennifer Lopez. No problem. I don't have a problem with your name or you with you. I have a problem with your work. I can make a good course for you up to seven days. When you you have a problem with my days. work. What's you, problem with my work? No, 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 no. It means I can I can make a good course for you. I can make you weak. I can. Make I mean, doesn't seem like I doesn't you. seem like you guys really know the data. You just give me examples, but when I ask you exactly. Who is a broker? Where's the load goes? It's just an example. So yeah, that the, that the things that things my dispatcher can tell you, but I'm in the sales department. As as I told you, I'm sales agent. But that things my dispatcher can tell you. When you talk to my dispatcher, he will tell you everything. He will tell you the oh. broker name. Okay, so can I talk to your dispatch load. team before I uh, commit to this relationship? Because I really want to see who is going to be dispatching the trucks. I'm not going to sign something without knowing that dispatcher knows zones, that he knows the times, that he knows the geography, mm -hmm. that he understand hours of service. Do they know hours of service? I can understand. Actually, Mr. Jennifer Lopez. Actually, the thing is that it's our company policy. I cannot forward you to my dispatch department when I have your documents. When I don't have your documents, and when you don't sign up. Okay, so, so let's 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 do let's do this, sir, because I am not gonna waste my time. I can tell you this. No, it, it's not. It will not wasting of your time. It just takes like three to five minutes. Send me your documents. I will assign your dispatcher, and you Sir, can talk to him. Sir, before I would commit to to any services and sign my documents, I need to make sure that you guys know what you're doing. And by just talking with, with your first associate, Actually, hold on, I'm talking right now. Before I'm talk, I talk with your first associate. Now I'm talking with you. I don't feel comfortable because it seems like you guys. Just trying to find desperate owner operators who have no clue about the truck and promising them thirty two hundred to Dallas, which does not exist in the last six months. Oh, actually, not six months, four months. So unfortunately, mm -hmm. yeah, Jennifer Lopez is not gonna work with Mr. Meyer because you making phone call and trying to sell the service and you have no clue what you trying to sell. 
Mm-hmm. Okay, I can understand. Just give me a second. Let me explain. Actually, ma'am, the thing is that uh, we are not doing any kind of contract over here. First of all, we are not doing any kind of contract over here. We will not bound you any contract. Like, you can take a call from the dispatcher, like, in totally free. You can take loads option totally free. We will not charge you any money for that. And we will not doing contract over here. It's just an agreement of seven days. If you want to work, you can take loads on our side. It just take loads option. If you don't want to work, you can leave us. We will not charge you any cancellation fee, any subscription fee, or any sign-up charges. Like nothing at all. It's totally free. You can take. Uh, you can see loads option. You can talk with the dispatcher, and you can sign up with me. But we are not doing any kind of contract that you are saying that you are want. You don't want to sign, uh, uh, like sign on any contract. There is no contract, ma'am. There's just an okay. That's fine. Day. Yeah, I understand. It's no contract. But you know what? I think in one week, mm-hmm. if I give you my four trucks, I'm going to be out of business because I am mm-hmm. more than sure no. that there are promises, promises, it, it's promises. Whatever. It's not the can real data. Just sign up one carrier with me, like last week. Uh, his name is uh, Array. And he just, uh, he was not like believe on me, but I was just asking him to try me for one week. But when he tried me for one week and the result of that, he was made like nine thousand three hundred and twenty five dollar with me yeah. how many miles that? yeah on how and many I miles he was run like and i believe he was run like 25 to three thousand miles nothing so, more i mean 25 that. and three. okay 25 25, 25 to, three. to three it's a big difference exactly how many miles did he have do you know exactly since Sorry? you'd say that exactly miles I, do you know I, that i don't I don't know the exactly miles, but it will be between twenty-five to three thousand. Because when I then sign up, when but I again, you just up, talk in examples, sir. In logistics, we need exactly. He had nine thousand yeah. dollar, a nine thousand gross. He drove thirty-one hundred miles because it makes a big difference. Three thousand and thirty-five hundred, five hundred extra. It makes a big difference because we calculate rate per mile, right? So exactly, how yeah, many how many miles That's did he run? That's why as you calculate the rate per mile. So that's why I'm saying when you work with me. So I'm how many, you gave me example. Pay. So how much Ray made and how many miles I'm, did he drove and which region did I'm, he drove? I'm just telling you. I'm Not just telling you, me, you just I'm, gave me an example. So can you answer exactly what okay. was his growth, what how I, many miles what I can do. and which region? Hmm. Which region was he driving what in? I can do. What I can do, Jennifer, what I can do, I can send you his invoice. You can see on that. How, how's that sound? Sounds great. Send me the invoice because it's going to be okay. easier for me like, to see. Just, just give me like five to ten minutes. I will get his invoice from my dispatch department and I will send it to you. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. Thank you. Okay. And then I'll give you a call and then let's see what okay. you can Sounds do good. what you can do for me. Okay. Thank you. Bye-bye. Is, is this your tech number? Yes, it is. So let's double check on that nonsense going to North uh, Dakota, Fargo, North Dakota, right? 666 miles pick up today. Delivery strict tomorrow in the morning, eight o'clock, which can be gel- uh, challenging because it depends how they gonna load him today. He might be not making as far as to uh, Fargo, North Dakota, but this is not is the biggest problem. So she said that they are flexible. The biggest problem is so first she said that she's paying 19. I asked for 22. Because it's 659 miles, at least I have to get extra because I know uh, North Dakota is not paying that much, so I need help. But look at this. I have to bring him back. Now my plan changed. I can go to Illinois, Indiana, Michigan, or close Wisconsin where he lives. How many loads do I have there for tomorrow? Oh my God, only seven. And only two are close by. Illinois for tomorrow. Is it still available? Yes, it is. What do you have, hon? I got a one and one picking up in Chicago, 60644. Uh, that's any time between 7 a.m. and 2 p.m. tomorrow. First mm-hmm. come, first serve. Okay. Then that's going to be delivering into Finley, Ohio, 45840. Mm-hmm. And that's going to be at 615 a.m. on Tuesday. 615 a.m.? Yeah. And what is the commodity? It's going to be palletized roof coating. And it's going to be 39,800 pounds. And how much are you paying? 
thousand dollars to the truck. Well, it's extra transit, hon. You know, it's extra Sorry, day. It's extra day in transit, so it cannot be just thousand dollars. Can I have the zip code for the delivery? Two hundred ninety-two miles was an extra day. If I do this, I have to be at least at fourteen hundred, hon. Uh huh. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye bye. Well, what do you want me to do? You want me to hold your cargo extra day because due to holidays. So I am using my dry land to hold your cargo. I understand it's a holiday. It's cool, but we're going to Ohio. We have all these tolls, and you want to pay me only thousand. It's a short haul. It has to be at least at least thirteen, fourteen hundred if I can do this. And delivery is going to be six. 15 a.m. So my driver has to leave night before or early, early on Monday. Do I want to punish my driver? No. I want him to enjoy his fireworks, wake up earlier, but not that early to be there at 6.15. Always think about your driver because he's the one who is making money for also, you. Also, I need to do setup now because we are not set up with this broker. I did check. Their rating is B, so they're good to go. Remember, I asked him. He wasn't that friendly guy, but I asked him, is it going to be set up by link or via PDF? He said by link, so it should be easy. That's what you do. You receive the link. You guys going to click on a link and it's going to take you to the third party. You're going to verify DOT MC for your carrier and it's going to, uh, you're going to answer the question and setup is going to be done in 30 seconds. So we're going to scroll down and we're going to agree, scroll down through agreement. We're not attorneys. We're not changing anything and we'll, uh, we are done. 30 seconds later, carrier uh, packet completed. Congratulations. You guys are going to receive email. And you... Paying goods, 43,000 pounds. It's moving that way for 1,100. 1,100. Uh, what time are we delivering tomorrow? Uh, I can deliver between 7 and 3. 7 and 3. Is there any way you can meet me at 13? Um. I can see what I can do for you. And I can see on your posting it says tanker endorsement. That, that driver does have tanker, correct? Yes, he does. Is it a tanker load? All right, give me one second. Correct. Okay. Yep, give me one second. Let me see what I can do. Mm -hmm. Thanks. To bring him back to Chicago tomorrow. One of the chances. Well, not that many load going back. Would you be able to meet me in the middle of 12? No, honey, 13 would be my lowest. Mm -hmm.